In this short clip, we're going to look at grid references. So let's take a look at the grid system. Take a look at this map. Can you see the faint blue lines up and across forming the grid? This grid of squares helps us map readers to locate a place. The vertical lines are called easterns, as they increase in value as you travel east on the map. And the horizontal lines are called northings, because they increase in value as you travel north. So before we look too closely at the map grid, let's zoom out and have a look at the national grid system. The UK is covered by grid squares measuring 100 kilometres across. Each grid square is identified by two letters, as seen here. As you can see, the South Lakes is covered by the two letters SD. On an OS paper map, you can find these in the corner square. And back to the map. Now let's have a look at how to take a grid reference. Start at the left-hand side of the map and go east until you get to the bottom left-hand corner of the square that you want. Write this number down. Move north until you get to the bottom left corner of the square that you want. Look at the number of this grid line and add it to the two-digit number that you already have. This is your four-figure grid reference. So in this case, the Tourist Information Office is in grid square 4733. Three. Sometimes it's necessary to be even more accurate. In this case, you can imagine that the grid is divided into 100 tiny squares. The distance between one grid line and the next is divided into tenths. First, find the four-figure grid reference, but leave a space after the first two digits. Estimate or measure how many tenths across the grid square your symbol lies and write this number after the first two digits. Next, estimate how many tenths up the grid square your symbol lies. Write this number after the last two digits. So now you have your six-figure grid reference. In this instance, the Tourist Information Office is located at 476334. So if you enjoyed this video and you would like to keep up to date with my navigation installments, please click the link below and go follow me on Instagram.